Newark, South Africa, weighing 220 pounds, Bray LaPen. Yes. Yes, sir, man. Wow. Here we go. Ray LaPen, you got it, Byron? Well, um, there we go. There I am. Yeah, that's okay, man. You know what I mean? It's Florida. It's <laughs> FCW. Ray LaPen. Anything can happen. Anything can happen, indeed. And Ray LaPen, one of the newest faces here in Florida Championship Wrestling, straight from Johannesburg, South Africa. And, and coincidentally, um, Ray actually uh, competed in South Africa against none other than our Florida Heavyweight Champion, Justin Gabriel. I tell you what, your wealth of information, but that is so true. When I seen this young man come in, he had his uh, his uh, portfolio, and you know what portfolio is? He had his portfolio with him. So South Africa, I said, wow. But he got his work cut out for him here, man. Wow, wow. what a specimen this Jackson Andrews is standing on side the ring. Yeah, I mean, it's a heck of a way to have to make your debut. I mean, you're against Kurt Hawkins, a former World Tag Team Champion in his own right, but then you got this imposing seven-footer on the outside watching your every move. Well, I tell you what, there's nobody more talented than Kurt Hawkins, as you oh. just said. Anytime you wear the uh, the gold and you wear the the, uh, the title of, of world champion anywhere in the WWE, it's a big deal. Wow, good snap suplex. Oh, covered by Lapan. Man, what a victory it would be to make your debut and, and capture a victory over Kurt Hawkins of all people. Well, it sure would. I'm going to tell you, but you got to keep your eye out there on Jackson oh. Andrews. That was a nice move. That's what I'm talking about talent-wise. Keep your eye on Kurt Hawkins, too. All the time. Can't take you off of it. There's been a little, uh, you know, a little uh, befuddled people in the camp of Kurt Hawkins and his former partner. Oh, watch out. Here's cover here by Hawkins. You know, uh, uh, Beretta and Croft. Yeah, what, you know? what's going on there? He just kind of like, I would just say he throwed him to the wayside. He put him on the side and said, hey, that's it. I'm going to bigger and better things. Bigger things being a seven foot two Jackson Andrews. Sort of like breaking up with your girlfriend and dating a new girl. Except she's seven feet tall. Well, I'm going to tell you what. If my girlfriend was seven foot tall, well, I won't see it on the air. But I'm telling you, man, that's a, that's a load. Oh, well, a very intimidating girl, as is a very intimidating man that Jackson Andrews watching in the distance. And surely very happy about what he's seeing so far. Kurt Hawkins controlling the situation. FCW, man, what a big matchup that we got tonight with DiBiase and Henning against Archer and Alex Riley. I mean, it's going to be a major event. You need to be uh, getting all your stuff from the kitchen, you know what I mean? Go to Icebox, get all your beverages, get everything ready. It's going to be a hot night right here at FCW. Bow! Oh, well, that match is a rivalry we've seen develop over the first few weeks, and that will actually be the first title defense for Brett DiBiase and Joe Henning. Look at Ray LePont taking it to Kurt Hawkins in every way possible. Well, he's got a good out. He's, he's got a good out. Oh, well, wow. that's it. This could be a major upset Sit right away. Out. Oh. Never seen that before. What's that? A sit out? Well, sit You call out. it a sit out. Well, he dragged his opponent off the rope, Kurt Hawkins, and drove yeah, him yeah. down in a powerbomb like maneuver. Oh. Speaking of which, how quickly things change. Kurt Hawkins. Head first go in. Here is your winner, Kurt Hawkins. A maneuver Kurt Hawkins calls the laugh riot. Take another look again. Ray LaPon again with that unique maneuver. He thought it was about to capture his first victory here in FCW. But just like that, the veteranism of Kurt Hawkins coming into play. Hitting what he calls the laugh riot and capturing well, folks, right now we're going to take this opportunity to send things over to our broadcast colleague, Courtney.